Good afternoon. Welcome back to Old Mountain Field here in Wakefield, Rhode Island. Tristan Hobbs, Caden Bailey. It's the Splash pregame show as the Waves get set to host the Newport Goals. Caden, uh, big win last night, 15 to five. Three straight victories, winning streak. How's it feel right now? Uh, it feels good. We got all parts of our team going: defense, pitching, uh, hitting. So we're just looking to keep it rolling tonight with a win. The last two nights, nine runs, 15 runs, 30 hits. The last couple of games, obviously, that's the most glaring thing that's been working well for your team. Contagious. It is. Hitting's definitely contagious. We've just been, we've been getting the right hits in the right spots. Runners on, doing the right thing. We need to just keep it up. Is it getting comfortable with bats? Is it getting comfortable with your team? Is it all of the above? It's all of them actually. It's, it's getting comfortable with pitching, the bats, and the team. And, and as as we go on and as we hit more and get more loose, I think we'll keep it up. And obviously, you mentioned hitting and defense, or defense and fielding as well, and pitching. How important has the bullpen been for this team? Uh, obviously, the last 14 to 30 innings scoreless from your bullpen. How crucial is that for a team? Oh, it's great. It gives us a lot of relief when we know if we put up a couple runs, we got trust in every one of our arms to do what they need to be done. And we know if we can take care of the D behind them, that we'll be in a good position. Defensively, you've moved over to third base the last three games. You played there all spring at Georgia State. You feel comfortable there, more comfortable than shortstop? Um, I am. It's just a different approach, different angle. But um, still, ultimately, you're just trying to catch the ball and throw it over to get the out. So. And I guess you mentioned different mentality. What's the biggest difference? Obviously, maybe you're closer, obviously, at third base, but for you, what's Closer, the knowing runners, knowing speed of runners, who's going to bunt, who's going to turn on the ball, um, just to give yourself positioning to know how to react to different players. It's a different. If you're going to grade yourself, what would, you, what would your best asset be at third base? Is your hands, your speed, your uh, mindset? Um, I would say um, just mental preparation, really. I try to go over a few things before every pitch and um, just so I'm mentally ready you know what to do with the ball when it comes to me. Uh, obviously a little bit different down, down in Georgia up here in New England. Uh, what's been the biggest maybe difference for you kind of adjusting to New England? Um, it hasn't been too bad. All the guys are really welcoming. They've all been great um, getting along with everybody. Uh, the weather, I know we had a couple of rain outs at the beginning of the year, but uh, ultimately it's been a great experience so far, and I'm looking forward to the rest of the season. And uh, I guess going forward, you guys are 6-6 six and six right now. Maybe something for you that you've come to the summer looking to improve upon. You're going to be a junior in the fall. Something maybe that you want to improve on as we go along here. Well, I'm always trying to improve on every aspect of my game every day. Uh, speed something I've been working on a lot this summer. And um, and obviously there's something you can learn from uh, each guy on this team brings something that you can learn. So it's good to pick up everything from them. And, and I'm just trying to work on all aspects of my game. Caden, thanks for joining us and good luck Thank tonight. You.